Oh look, it's Bonix following everybody around. We still got a worm problem. Friggin' infestation of worms are still here, but they're going away little by little. And Bonix, Bonix doesn't want to eat her food with all that crap in there. What do you think about that, Bonix? You'd rather just eat some leaves and some other junk on the ground? <laughs> yeah, they're all around our pottery basket here. I don't know why. But they're not as many as they used to be. The storm we had the other day has wiped out all the webs, which is great, so you can actually walk outside now without getting covered. What is it, Bonix? You want to see these worms go away too? I'll bet you do. These are just annoying. Look, they're all in your water bowl. I gotta clean that anyway. That's looking nasty from the rain. Mm, we're, not, we're not gonna make meatballs out of Bonix. What's going on? Just patrolling. Keep it away from those nasty worms. You see one hanging somewhere. Yep. Little oh, shits. Is that right? Yeah, I wanna cook her for Cinco de Mayo. Ah, really? Uh huh, yeah. Cinco de Mayo meatballs. Cinco de Mayo meatballs. Rabbit meatballs? Nah, I don't think so. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, good. Okay. Look. Flowers. Uh, look, more flowers. Oh, look. More bonics running around my feet. Look, one single flower here. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me show off the flower garden here. More azaleas around our yeah our rose bush. Those worms ate every single leaf off of the rose bush. Hopefully it'll grow back, but uh, I don't know. Even this tree behind it has been pretty much devoured. Won't touch the poison ivy though. Amazing thing. Well, that's kind of funny. All this crap on the ground looks like it's. Looks like the we had a bunch of more leaves on the oak tree and all the leaves are pretty much stripped off. I mean there's patches there on that side, but I mean the rest of well, the leaves have been eaten off by all these damn worms. It's crazy. Yeah, grass is getting long. More flowers. And more flowers. And what's left of our big giant pine from the snowstorm? It's now just a stump. More azaleas. More friggin' azaleas. Probably some wildlife around here. I don't know. Squirrels. More azaleas. The old rabbit cage. This fence. Put that up here eventually. More azaleas. Holy crap. We got them in all colors back here. We had a mag well, we had some flowers on this magnolia tree, but they're gone now. And there's worms all over it too, but they don't seem to be eating the leaves. Those leaves seem to be uh, doing just fine. But then there's these azaleas that uh, they've pretty much been devoured as well by those by those worms. But they always seem to grow back. We've got our gardenias. Lawnmower doesn't work, huh? Probably got rained on. Probably should get rid of that thing. And more of bonics. What's up? Gonna run around in circles again. Look at my feet.
And yeah, the sitting area is kind of a mess right now because of the uh, storms and worms. So I'm sure the wife will have fun cleaning that up. And what else? Not a whole lot else really to report. Some azaleas here, some are starting to bloom here. And what else? Uh, our fountain is looking like a swamp. I'll have to clean that out. We had some flowers here, they're gone, and our big aloe plants that we protect in the wintertime. Another one in bamboo. And then we have our uh, I keep forgetting the names of these things, but they don't survive well here in the climate because it gets too cold for them, but these are more like a desert style, southwestern style plant. They're all over the place in Mexico. I've seen these, but I have to bring them in every, uh, every year. And this is our avocado, which is getting eaten up by those worms. That eh, figures. Ah. And more flowers. Yep. Just have to clean this up, get it more organized or something. Eventually. And there you have it. And a bumblebee. The wildlife, ladies and gentlemen. So, until next time. Adios.